In this short video, I'm going to show you how to create a nice neat finish with your bias binding when it comes to sewing your bunting. So the first step is to iron your bias binding in half. All you need to do is literally fold it in half and iron it flat. This just gives you a really nice channel in which to place the bunting flags and means you get a nice crisp even finish all the way along. Now to create a neat end, what you want to do is open out your bias binding until it's completely flat. Fold in about one centimetre and then fold all of the sides back in. Once you've done that, it creates a nice neat end for you. Take a pin and pin it into place if you need to, but then all you need to do is sew as you would normally along the edge and you'll get a nice neat end, which won't fray and will last for ages. So that's it. Fold your ends in and then just sew all of your flags into this channel and you'll have a lovely neat binding.